Local venues that would normally be rocking on a Friday night are now much quieter. It's, it's very eerie. The coronavirus pandemic has definitely been a challenge for spots like Play Louisville. Honestly, our goal for this year is to break even. That's why the National Independent Venue Association is making a push to Congress to provide more funding to these types of venues. As soon as we were allowed to reopen, our costs, costs don't stay, you know, they go up, you know, so instantly we're like, we, you know, we want to start seeing people, but then we're limited on how many people we can let in. This initiative is called the Save Our Stages campaign. We can't operate at zero revenue and with refunds, we're at negative revenue. Headliners Music Hall's Billy Hardison says the legislation the campaign supports is the Restart Act, which is meant to support businesses affected by the pandemic. This will allow us the type of funding we need to be on ice, the life support we need so we can come back and be here and be the cornerstone businesses that neighborhoods count on. Hardison says so far there have been a million people who have reached out to Congress to push for action on this program. Someone who knows just how important support is right now is Galaxy in Nulu. It received money from the Paycheck Protection Program. We would not have our doors open in my mind had we not gotten that. General Manager Bradley Hammond believes it's vital as well, especially if businesses like his, which rely on good crowds, want to be ready to serve the community once this pandemic comes to an end. Everybody's going stir crazy, and I think we all can agree that at the end of this, we're gonna wanna get back out in the world and start living again. Andrew Chernoff, WLKY News. In the meantime, the venues are all coming up with ideas on how to keep the public safe when they are allowed to reopen at full capacity.